Hey guys, it's Jim Aron here, back with another vlog and today is going to be a fun day because today we'll be taking a look at one of the most expensive parking lots which I have seen over here in Dubai. So it's going to be pretty exciting because we are only getting started. To start off, we have this beautiful Mercedes limousine. It says Mercedes 1000 IS. It's, I have no clue to be honest, but it's a limousine. It has three doors on it and not only that, so this is the car lineup which I was talking about. None of these cars are abandoned by the way, it's all owned by a dealership and this is their parking lot to say the least. So to start off, we have my dream car which is a Audi RS6. Just take a look at this beauty right here. But this is not any ordinary Audi RS6. This is actually a Mansuri Audi RS6. So as a result, it has this beautiful kit on. Let's just take a look at this bumper. Look man, it looks beautiful. And cars like this, go for around 1 million dirhams so that is also here so the most expensive Audi RS6 is over here in Dubai and it's a Mansuri Audi RS6 to be honest it looks way more aggressive than the normal Audi RS6 so that is also there and over here we have some Porsches to start off we have a Porsche Macan S I feel like this is the cheapest car which they have over here and over here we have a Porsche 911 S it looks beautiful. It has done around 4,000 kilometers. It's a 2021 model. It's a Carrera Turbo S convertible. So this is easy. 700k. We have a GT 63S. We have a GTS 4.0. We have another Porsche. And over there we have another Audi RS, which is again my dream car. And it looks beautiful. This is an auto green color. So if I am getting an Audi RS, it will be in this color. Because to be honest, Ferrari has red. Just like that, Audi has an auto green. An auto grey looks very good in Audis to be honest and over here we have a matte black Cadillac Escalade, we have a Bentley Continental, we have a GLE, we have another Bentley Continental, we have a Rolls Royce Cullinan in auto grey and it's pretty dusty, especially this Bentley looks pretty dusty man. I feel like it's because it's under the tree or something like that but over here we have another Bentley Continental, but oh, this is a special, it's a hybrid Bentley Bentayga, sorry my bad, I said, I think I said Bentley Continental, but it's a hybrid Bentley Bentayga, I didn't know this car exists, so, so anyway, we have a Nardo Grey Rolls Royce calling and over here, with this blue stripe on it, and yes, it's a black badge, as you guys can see it from the Infinity badge, which they have over here, so it's a black badge Rolls Royce calling, and we have another Audi RS6, so in total, we have around three Audi RS6 in this lot right here, we have a Phantom drop head, and a lot of cars man it's insane i mean the sheer amount of cars which they have over here let me know how much do you think this entire parking lot is worth and over here we have three mercedes we are now one is in brabus the other one is as a maybach in ornament and the other one is a normal mercedes we are now and over here we have a brabus mercedes g63 it's a brabus 800 that means this car has around 800 horsepower we have a mansuri lamborghini Urus. to be honest I'm not a huge fan of Man City Lamborghini, especially they have a one with yellow in color. I think it's pretty atrocious to say the least. And over here we have a Rolls Royce Wraith, Bentley Ventega again. That is a Mercedes GLS 600 Maybach, aka the dancing car. We have another Bentley Ventega. And so anyway, let's go inside and take a look at the other cars which they have over here. Over here we have another drink car of mine which is a Mercedes AMG GT 63S. It looks stunning in this color right here, man. It looks beautiful. Another Rolls Royce color in it, but this is not black badge. Or is it black badge? I don't think so it's a black badge because usually black badge has four seats on it, but this is a five seater. So let me know in the comments below. Over here, we have a Aston Martin DB9 proper James Bond kind of car right here. We have a green color Rolls Royce. Gosh, but this is my first time seeing a Rolls Royce in this color let me know what do you guys think about this color right it looks beautiful to me it's pretty unique over here we have a matte black mercedes amg g63 with double night package so that is also pretty interesting over here we have a mansuri bentley bentega i have never seen a mansuri bentega before but this is insane especially the number plate huh? g1000 it looks beautiful and i like the body kit with it and this is the first edition Bentley Bentayga, by the way. We have another Rolls Royce Continental Range Rover, BMW 8 Series, Mercedes GLE. It's filled with cars. So we are only getting started. 
And one car which actually caught my attention is that one right there. That is a Mercedes G63 6x6. But this is not any ordinary G63 6x6. It's a Brabus 6x6 700. And what that means is, is that this is one of 15. And seven of these cars are over here in Dubai. So that shows the sheer amount of wealth Dubai has. It's easily a $1 million car and it has six wheels on it. And to be honest, I feel like the only person who made this car famous has to be Richard Hammond. It's huge, bro. Oh my God. V8 by turbo 700. So it produces over 700 horsepower. It's insane, especially the Brabus kit on it. Phew, the amount of carbon fiber this car has, man. It's mad. And over here, we have another Bentley Bentayga. It's 2023, zero kilometers, European spec. Over there, we have a lime yellow Rolls-Royce Cullinan. Guys, this is not any ordinary Rolls-Royce Cullinan right here. It comes with a matte yellow finish on it. And I'm pretty sure this is not a wrap. It's a factory color right here. So that is also pretty interesting. And this is the Aventador SVJ in its full glory right here. I could be wrong, but I feel like this G63 6x6 is the most expensive car which they have inside this lot. Then it might be the SVG and the Rolls-Royce calling in. But phew, SVG looks too good, man. It's a future classic right here. It even comes with white seats on the inside as well. And over here, we have another GLS 600 Maybach, but this one has a wide body kit to it. So I'm pretty sure even this car is Man City. So that is also there. But the interior is beautiful, not gonna lie. It has a red and beige interior to it. It looks beautiful. But I like the Mansuri body kit which they have done on this car right here. And that, my friends, is a Lamborghini Aventador SVJ. One of 800, matte white in color. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. But it looks beautiful. There's no way I can go in between these spaces. That's how tightly packed these cars are. That is an Aston Martin DBX 707. We have a Charger SRT and a Challenger Hellcat. I think, or is it a Challenger SRT? I'm not sure. We have to go on that side to check that out. But anyway, another GT63 S. Lincoln Navigator, Bentley Continental, Bentley Ventega again, GLE 450, Rolls Royce Cullinan. Look at the distance, by the way. Oof. The person who parked this car has to be a legend, man. Over there, we have a McLaren 720S. This is a Ferrari Portofino. These cars are like very tightly packed. So that's something which I like. We have the brand new McLaren GT or Arturo. I'm not sure about this car right here. Let me know what you guys think. I think it's the McLaren GT. I could be wrong. We have another 911 Turbo S. We have a Ferrari GTC4 Luso over here. Is it the GTC4 Luso or Ferrari FF? I could be wrong. But I think it's the GTC4 Luso. Over here we have another Porsche 911 Turbo. And this, my friends, is a Ferrari F430. Bentley over there. Another Bentley over here. This is a Bentley Mulsanne with a W12 engine on it. This car lineup is insane. Let me know in the comments below how much this entire parking lot is worth. Because it's insane, bro. So, as I said, uh, this... It's a Challenger SRT. So that is also there. As a modern DB9, we already talked about these cars. But this car lineup is something unique right here. I think it's easily $50 million. Let me know in the comments below how much do you guys think this entire car lineup is worth. We have an Aston Martin Super Legier, a DBS Super Legier. It's insane. Well, I really like this car, man. The interior is too sexy. Too James Bondish. It's pretty dusty because it's been sitting under a tree. If I was the wrong from 2017, then I would have made this an abandoned car. But it's not. Suppose see, we have another BMW i8 over here. It's pretty rare to see this car over here in Dubai. So anyway, guys, that was the car lineup which they had over here. I hope you guys like this video. So if you guys want more videos like this, then make sure to subscribe with the like button and share this video. Till then, it's about Ryan signing off.